Happy Saturday morning, Battlefield Nation. Big Sean Kramar is here in the studio. We are back with another brand new edition of Saturday Morning Superstars, our flagship show, right here on YouTube and, of course, the premier streaming network. And this week, folks, we have got a great slate of action lined up for you. We're going to cover the rise of Terry Adonis, the thoroughbred Terry Adonis. Terry's been through so much in recent months, and he's had issues with South Philly's finest, but he was able to defeat both members of South Philly's finest and earn an opportunity at the BPW Futures Championship. This week, you're going to see each and every bit of that. Terry Adonis takes on both members of South Philly's finest, and you will see the match, the crowning achievement of Terry Adonis' young career, where he took on Sam Adams for the Futures Championship. But of course, the line Luca Brasi had other plans, and you'll get to see at the end of the show what that means. But I'm sure you're tired of me speaking, so with that being said, it's time for wrestling action, and that time is right now. Three more great A contest here at Glory Road. Let's send it to Sage and see what's up next. Introducing first. Here we go, Sean. You know, we've talked all night about some great wrestlers, but I, I really don't think I like anybody in the battlefield more than I like South Philly's finest. Conway and Brazzi, what an incredible team, but tonight, South it's Philly's just Luca Brazzi. He, he had a great performance Luca last month at the Brazzi. Futures Tournament. And he's here to maybe get a W in the win column, and I think he can do it. Yeah, uh, yeah. Luca Brazzi's been on a roll for sure. We've seen a ton of growth in the in-ring ability of Luca Brazzi, that's to say the least. But I just want to take a moment and touch on the fact that I can't stand South Philly's finest, especially that damn Jimmy Conway. I'll never forget the day where this man's attitude went south. He shoved me into a wall, almost knocked me on my behind. And I'm a bigger gentleman, you know this. You're, you're sitting here with me right now. The force Jimmy Conway threw behind that for literally no reason at all shows me what type of people these dirty, grimy bastards actually are. Listen, Jimmy Conway, like everybody here in the battlefield, is just trying to make a living. And this man, he, he's passionate about his craft. Yeah, passionate or whatever the case may be, there's a way you should act and a way you shouldn't act, and South Philly's finest are on the wrong side of that equation each and every day of the week. Twice on Sunday. There we are. Baby powder in the sky. As we've come to expect each and every time we see South Philly's finest here in the battlefield, but tonight, like you said, Luca Brazzi, he's in one-on-one -on -one action, and he's got his hands full with the thoroughbred Terry Adonis. Look at Sage, very uncomfortable by Jimmy Conway's actions right now. And I, I can't blame her, Connor, can you? And his opponent. Jimmy Conway in the front row running his mouth. Bailey from the Valley of Pennsylvania. Oh, oh yeah, you believe oh, yeah. this reaction. Can you Terry, believe this? All right, so the deal when it comes to Terry Adonis, I'm gonna tell you right now is they call him the thoroughbred for a reason, Connor. Terry Adonis, this man was bred for athletic success. Listen, Look at the build on this gentleman. Look at the height on this gentleman. You wanna talk about a five-tool player. This man is a historic loser. I have known Terry Adonis my entire Will life. Will you stop? I have known Terry Adonis Connor, my entire Connor. life. This man, he couldn't win in football, Connor. and now he can't win in professional wrestling. Luca Brasi is going to be the biggest challenge of this man's life. Connor. There's no way he's going to jump that hurdle, Sean. Connor, can you just take five minutes and speak logically? Can you be a journalist? You're here to be a journalist. This is not journalism. This, whatever it is that's coming out of your mouth. Everything that you said about Terry Adonis makes zero sense. 
Zero. An shot. athletic. What, are you kidding me? I'd like to see you get in there and take on Terry Adonis. I could take on Terry Adonis. Yeah. Any day of the week. Yeah, 27 seconds is all it would take for you to be looking up at those lights and the, and the count to be one, two, three. And those 27 seconds include the entire time it takes you to walk to the ring. Oh, I'll tell you what. Talk about walking to the ring. Terry Adonis always taking his sweet time. Now, Terry Adonis, calm, cool, and collected. That's what you get out of the thoroughbred. But here we go. The bell has sounded. We are underway. Glory Road continues. The thoroughbred Terry Adonis, the line Luca Brazzi, and it is right now. Big Sean Kramers and CJD on the call. We are live at the Battlefield Performance Center on the Premier Streaming Network and on YouTube. Ah, yeah, come on. And of course, on all forms of social media, search Battlefield Pro Wrestling for the latest news. Terry Adonis right now. You don't want to, I'm telling you right now, Sean, oh. you don't want to swap holds with Luca Brazzi. Oh, no, Luca Brazzi just shrugging off Terry Adonis right there, and that's no small feat. This is a man <laughs> patting his head. Yeah, I'm not sure that Terry Adonis is going to take that sort of disrespect laying down, but we shall see Adonis looking frustrated, looking ready to fight. Luca Brazzi is an East Coast legend. Terry Adonis is in his third match. Connor, the thing is, you use that word legend a little bit loosely here, especially if you're referring to Luca Brazzi and any member of South Philly's finest. But Terry Adonis right now, Irish whip off the ropes, and that big shoulder sends Brazzi right down to the canvas. High impact from the thoroughbred himself, Terry Adonis. There we go. Look at that athleticism. You want to talk about Terry? Oh, Absolutely. Terry stalking his prey right now, and once again with another beautiful arm drag. Oh, wait a minute. Belly to belly and a boot. The power of the thoroughbred. You can't deny it, Connor. You cannot deny I, it. I can't deny that was that was a nice, nice overhead suplex. But Luca Bratti and, and Jimmy out here trying to regroup. Bratti a bit of a mess right now, and can you blame him? That that belly to belly throw led to his skull bouncing off of that canvas. But Terry Adonis has to be careful to not get involved in the hoopla on the outside because you gotta believe this is a plan by Conway. And there you see it, right oh. there, straight <laughs> to the steel post off of the distraction from Jimmy Conway. Talk about using your environment. This is that experience advantage, Sean. I'm telling you, Terry Adonis doesn't have what it takes to take on Luca Brazzi. Yeah, you could be a thoroughbred all you want, but you got, oh my goodness, did you hear that knife edge chop? Wow, the chest of Terry Adonis just turned six different colors of black and blue. My goodness. On the outside, our official Tiffany distracted by Luca Brazzi, and this is, this is throw him out. Throw Jimmy Conway out of this I building. Said it earlier, what business Sean. does he have here tonight? This is a singles contest. I'll say it again. If a tree falls in the forest and Tiffany did not see what was going on here, again, anything oh, how to win. How South convenient. Philly's finest. And you can hear the Battlefield Nation lighting up right now. Chance of Terry, 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 and can you blame them? Adonis. There we go. Up against it tonight, dealing with Jimmy Conway and that numbers game. No one here to help him because Adonis does things the right way. He's not a cheater. He's not a he's not a dirtbag. But we can't say the same about Conway or Brazzi. Armbar locked in right now, and Terry Adonis has so to that, force his way out that's right now. Violence. From Luca Brazzi here. That arm joint's only meant to bend so far. Brazzi working this hold hard. And that spells trouble for Terry Adonis. When you take away this man's shoulder, you take away a massive portion of his offense because a lot of it's power based and requires that upper body strength. If you've only got one working shoulder, half of that offense goes out of the window, Connor. And that's, you know, that, again, that's that textbook. The Luca Brazzi brings. He's such an incredible hold worker. He and knows you're his seeing, submissions. You're seeing this have a major effect on Terry Adonis right here. We are live, Broadheadsville, Pennsylvania, the go. Battlefield Performance Center. Big Sean Kramars, Connor here on the call. Hashtag Glory Road. We are live on the Premier Streaming Network, as well as YouTube, Battlefield Pro Wrestling, everywhere you want to be. Coming right into your living room live. And Terry Adonis is about to sleep. There's the second one. Come on. Just end this already, Tiffany. Come on. There's no life this left guy's in Adonis. Out. Oh, wait just a minute. Oh, Terry Adonis going to that reserve tank. Saved only for emergency situations. And that's what we've got right here. Look at the power and strength of Adonis. Tiffany getting out of dodge. And that's the break Adonis needed. 
But Luca Brazzi still in much better shape than the thoroughbred. Up to the second row. There we oh, go. Right on the slash. leg. Right to that knee. Just two. And shout out to Luca Brazzi on varying the offense, spending time on the shoulder, spending time on the leg. And if you notice, Connor, he's picking opposite sides of the body. I'm telling you, man. He's trying to mess up the entire offense of, of the thoroughbred Terry Adonis this right now. This guy is cerebral. He's picking a limb on either side. He's trying to stop the thoroughbred for being able to use that, you know, that textbook offense of his, that big power, that big speed. If he can take out a leg, there goes the sprinting ability of the thoroughbred. He can take out an arm, no more suplexes. Luca Brazzi is a student of the game, and, Ther and Terry Adonis, he he's learning. He's getting taken to school. Brazzi perched on the top rope, let's see. Oh, and a oh! pick from Adonis! Caught Luca Brazzi right in that kneecap. Brazzi lands hard on his knee. Absolutely, all the velocity coming out of the sky, getting met with a foot and then smashing into the canvas. Talk about a trifecta of disaster for the line, Luca Brazzi. Oh, big back elbow by Adonis. He's starting to come to life. Adonis, let's see. Got him set. Big Samoan drop. Oh, oh and a kip up. Adonis is back. Punch him right in the mouth, Terry. Punch him right in the mouth. There goes Conway. Massive elbow smash, Luca Brazzi in trouble. Come on, Brazzi. Terry Adonis, like a hawk, stalking his prey. Oh, got him set, maybe an Alabama slam, let's see. Got it, Luca oh. Brazzi <laughs> spun, bounced off My that gosh. campus. Adonis with the cover, this is it, upset two. And Jimmy Conway, get him out of here. Get him out of here, now. No, oh, I've had enough. Jimmy trying to get in on this match. Oh, and there oh. goes Conway taking a spill on the outside. Oh, wait a minute, Adonis one more time. Big opportunity trying to put away Brazzi right now. Big Samoan draw. Oh, wait oh. a minute, Chris. Hey, Luca, Luca. Oh, oh man. there we go. And I'm telling you, Sean, it's the experience. Terry Adonis, Ladies another loss, I'm telling you. This guy is a historic loser. Luca Brazzi on top, South Philly's finest, living up to their name. All right, and once again, as it is with typical Connor, he leaves out the facts and the important parts of the discussion. If not for the interference of Jimmy Conway and that spill right there, we would not see these closing moments of the contest. Harry Adonis looked like he had things in hand, looked like he was in control. Samoan drop, but the wily veteran Luca Brasi taking advantage. Tiffany counts three, and your winner continuing his role is the line Luca Brasi. Well, the facts are this is a massive victory for the line Luca Brazzi. Terry Adonis has maybe the biggest upside to anybody here in the Futures division, but Luca Brazzi just put him down. Again, not without the help of Jimmy Conway, but nevertheless, let's give it up for Terry Adonis. What an effort. This kid has such a bright future. Oh, but this is the thing, Connor. We're not done. Let's send it back to Sage Santiago as we get tag team warfare underway. Listen to the Battlefield Nation. Give all the love to Terry Adonis. 2023 saw Battlefield Pro Wrestling rise from the ashes and claim their rightful spot atop the independent pro wrestling mountain. Delivering over 30 live events, champions were crowned, alliances were forged, and unthinkable betrayals reared their ugly heads. Nonetheless, as one chapter comes to a close, the inception of the next chapter is upon us. The first ever BPW World Heavyweight Champion, truly blessed, Casey Navarro, makes his first title defense against Spencer Slade. Newly crowned BPW Tag Team Champions, Championship Material, defend their titles against the upstart Vetrano Brothers. Medal of Liberty winner, Luca Brazzi, looks to remain BPW Futures Champion as he goes head-to-head -head with Lance Onawaii. The Battle of the Big Men sees Ox Adams defending his home field against debuting Bobby Buffet. Kate Thorne and Vicious Vicky take to the ropes in bombshells action. And also in action representing BPW Futures are Team JJ and El Lobo taking on Terry Adonis, Danger Jameson, and RJ Carnage in six-man tag action. Come and be a part of Battlefield's first pay-per-view event of 2024, Inception. 
5, January 28th at the Signature Event Center. 137 Aaron Lane, Broadhead, Pennsylvania. Tickets are on sale now or catch us streaming live on the Premier Streaming Network. Welcome to the Battlefield! Welcome, Connor. How you doing, buddy? Sean Kramars, I cannot believe it has been a month already. I cannot wait to call this action, unfortunately, next to you. But here we go. St. Santiago, here in the ring, getting ready. Oh, are you kidding me? You gotta be kidding me, Sean. And we are live in Broadheadsville, Pennsylvania. And you know what time it is. I know what time it is. Everyone knows what time it is. Here comes the thoroughbred. There he is. Sean, I haven't even been sitting for 30 seconds and my night is ruined. I have to come out here and watch Terry Adonis again. I, I mean, the last time I saw him, he lost. Every other time I've seen him, he's lost. Why is this guy still here? I happen to disagree with every word that just came out of your mouth, CJD. Terry Adonis, you want to talk about the fastest rising star in the battlefield? You need to look no further than a guy like Terry Adonis. Terry Adonis trying to win some brownie points. Terry Adonis doesn't need brownie points. He goes and out his here and opponent. gets results. And here we go, talk about a real wrestler, Sean. Jimmy Conway of South Philly Philly's from finest. the streets of South Philadelphia, weighing in at 210 pounds. He is being accompanied tonight by the line, Luca Barazzi, the gent, Jimmy Conway. And as St. Santiago said, now entering the battlefield is the gent himself, Jimmy Conway. One of the most despicable human beings I've come across in recent memory. Jimmy Conway is a winner, Sean. He's not despicable. He just does whatever needs doing to win a match. And he's being accompanied by, oh, would you look at that? Another Terry Adonis loss in Luca Brasi. I, things are about to go bad for the thoroughbred once again. Jimmy Conway, Luca Brasi, they have a game plan. Do you think, do you, do you honestly think the thoroughbred has a game plan tonight? You know, I happened to speak to Terry Adonis just before this contest, and what Terry Adonis has been doing for the past three weeks, the minute he found out about this contest, he immediately began watching tape. And I'll tell you what, South Philly's finest, our veterans, they've been in this industry quite a long time and have been a lot of different places. And with that being said, there was a lot of tape to watch, and Terry Adonis consumed all of that tape. So. With that being said, Terry Adonis is ready for this contest. He was born ready. Terry Adonis did the research. He did the study. He's a student of the game. And you don't become successful by not being a student of the game. Well, I tell you what, Sean, you can't really talk about success and Terry Adonis in the same breath, but I'll save mine. Jimmy Conway, Terry Adonis, we're about to start this thing. Well, Jimmy Conway asking everybody who's the man, and I don't think anybody in the building today would agree that it's him. I, I certainly don't. I, I don't know about you, I, I definitely do, Sean. I told you a million times, I'll tell you a million times again. Well, nevertheless, it is about time to get this contest started. It looks like uh, South Philly's finest didn't bring any of that prosciutto with them. <laughs> it's pursuit. I, I thought it was Gabagool, Sean. It's I not really, Gabagool, it's know pursuit. The, you know, I can't be Just out. like everything else about oh, South Philly's yeah. finest, the Gabagool's a lie. It's pursuit. I saw it, you saw it, we all saw it. But nevertheless, this is a big, big opportunity for the young Terry Adonis, the thoroughbred. He's, uh, he's been climbing the ranks here in the battlefield, and I'll tell you what, he fell just short against Luca Brazzi like you unfortunately had to remind us of. But tonight is an opportunity right here at Battlefield Pro Wrestling Futures Uprising for Terry Adonis to beat a veteran, to beat one of the faces of Battlefield Pro Wrestling. And if Terry Adonis gets this victory, CJD, well, say me, whatever you want to say, but am I right or am I wrong when I say that if Terry Adonis beats Jimmy Conway today, he levels up 10. My, my opinion out the window, Terry Adonis needs this win tonight because he is on a multiple match losing streak. I believe it's coming up on, it, it's a two or three match losing streak at this point. Terry needs to beat Jimmy and what a win it would be. 
He needs to get himself back on track, and Jimmy Conway is here to make sure he does it. Well, that remains to be seen, but our official Tiffany has asked for the bell. It has sounded. We are underway. It's the thoroughbred. It's the gent. It's right now. We are live on the Premier Streaming Network and on YouTube. Battlefield Pro Wrestling Futures. The future of the battlefield lives here, and the future is right now, CJD. Indeed, it is Jimmy Conway. Still, uh, you know, he, he's getting a feel for Terry Adams. He, he, he was here last, last month at the last future show in the corner of Luca Brasi, and he saw how Terry Adonis, how Terry Adonis works in that ring. Now, Terry Adonis, like I said, they call him a thoroughbred for a reason. He is a technician, and not to mention an absolute powerhouse inside of that squared circle. And Jimmy Conway right now is showing that South Philly's finest is just code word for being a coward. No, no, he, again, Sean, he's, he's feeling him out. He's trying to figure out where he has to strike. Again, that game plan I was talking about. Terry still, if Terry, if Terry was smart, he'd be going after Jimmy, but he's not. So here we go. Jimmy's just picking his spots. And Terry Adonis is not gonna take a shove like that. You saw that firing back. There's only so much, but do not let Brasi distract you. Rookie mistake. There we go. Him. This is what I was talking about. You get Brassi to oh, take away right. the attention, and now we got Jimmy Conway doing what he does best, a big strike in the corner on the thoroughbred. Oh my goodness, a cap, a couple of world-shattering right hands, and a nasty knife edge chop has Terry Adonis reeling right now. Tiffany checking on him. The Conway, oh man, these rights are stinging today. Big shots from Jimmy Conway. Terry Adonis trying to change things. And Adonis explodes with a clothesline right now. And you see the thoroughbred, that is a pure athlete. And Jimmy Conway, I'm not sure he knows what he's in for right now. Luca Brasi's got to give him some counseling on the outside. Terry, oh! Big sliding drop kick, taking out Brazi. That's got to feel good for the thoroughbred after last month. You know, I'll tell you what, that was my favorite thing I've seen so far today, right? Luca Brazi deserves three of oh, those. Oh, come on. This shouldn't be allowed. Wait just a minute. Is it time right now? Massive right hand delivered by Adonis. Come on, take him around to the whole battlefield. Let everybody get a shot in. Terry, bring him over here. I owe this guy a shot. Terry Adonis is going to make it happen. Here we go. Oh, oh, what a oh. shot by the youth God, this, of the battlefield. How is this loud? This should, that should be a disqualification. <laughs> Tiffany, what are you doing in there? Listen, fan interaction is a must here in the battlefield, and if you show up to a BPW show, you never know, you might get to punch Jimmy Conway. I mean, why wouldn't you want to punch Jimmy Conway? Don't you want to punch Jimmy Conway? I don't want to punch Jimmy Conway. I want to punch Jimmy, Jimmy Conway. Look at what Terry Adonis is doing here. He's, you know, he's cheating on the outside. Now he's using the ring to his advantage. Can this guy actually get it done or what? Adonis is beating Conway from pillar to post right before our eyes, and Brasi up on the apron again. Just throw him out. Just throw, he doesn't even, what's he even out here for? Terry, do not fall for this again. Oh, Big right come hand. Brasi went to the outside. Oh, there we go. Massive knee directed to the middle of the spine, and Adonis to the outside. Yeah. Falling for the trap once again. He's the thoroughbred. He's maybe our fastest rising star. He's all of these things, but one thing you... And Bratzi on yeah. the outside. Come on, Bratzi. Come on, what are we doing? Let's do this. Oh, there we go. This is ridiculous. Somebody's got to turn around right now. Look up. Oh. They just destroyed Terry Adonis. That chair just disintegrated. Terry Adonis wrecked on the outside. Why is Luca Brasi still here? What I told you earlier, Sean, it's the game plan. Look at where Terry Adonis is right now. Brasi and Conway have him scouted. This is academic. I don't believe your definition of academic is correct. As long as Terry Adonis is still breathing, he's got a chance. But let's take another look at this impact from Luca Brasi right through that steel chair. My goodness. Unbelievable turn of events here in the battlefield. And Terry Adonis, this, the entire trajectory of this contest changed before our eyes right there. But not before Tiffany's eyes because of the damn distraction from Conway. Not you, Jimmy Conway. <laughs> Jimmy Conway, all the confidence in the world, and he's earned it. He's earned it, Sean. I, I can't see Terry Adonis getting up after this. No, I mean, let's see. It remains to be seen right now, but you're right, Terry Adonis is in a bad way right now. And the gent Jimmy Conway, 
just taking advantage of the opportunity that Luca Brazzi created for him, not himself. Oh, what a boot right to the temple, Connor. Big boot to Terry Adonis. Jimmy is making this, you know, he is surgical with this. He is just oh, yeah. oh, man, oh, yeah. come on. That's what I'm talking come on, about. Come on, this ref is in Terry Adonis' pocket. Are you kidding me? Oh, what you got to do is respect the officials on the battlefield, and if somebody's not going to tolerate disrespect, 100% it's Tiffany. Well, Tiffany has let children slap the gent, and now she just put her hands on him. What is this? Terry Adonis, though, back to the contest, is still reeling this man. And again with a right hand from Brotzi. Terry Adonis deserves everything that's coming to him. He's paid off this referee. He's paid off the ref. You're, you're out of your mind. I'm not out of my mind. Is it not? Is it not blatantly obvious, Sean? Who delivered your milk this morning? Let's <laughs> Well, nevertheless, Jimmy Conway. So, Kyler, what was in it? I... Not you, Jimmy Conway. Not you. Oh, and a right from Adonis. Adonis firing back right now. Shot to the midsection, and Conway ending the rally before he got going. Beautiful Big snap suplex by the gent. Well, Connor, your boy's doing a great job of handling Adonis right now. Terry's Absolutely. on the brink of disaster. It, it, you know, Sean, it was it was that it was that you know that move from Luca Brazzi off, off the apron. I'm telling you, it's, they had the game plan. Then they're executing it perfect, Connor. Yeah. The ref didn't see Connor, it. It never ask, happened. Let me ask you a question. What did the what did the what did the card read today? Uh, it read uh, Jimmy Conway and, and Luca Brazzi versus the Thoroughbred. No, it was it was. Jimmy Conway versus the third of Terry Adonis and Luca Brazzi doesn't even belong out here right now. Well, so the turning point of the contest is a farce. Oh, this no. entire situation that Terry Adonis finds himself in right now is a farce. And Adonis has got to overcome great odds right now. But if there is anybody in the battlefield that's capable of overcoming anything, without a doubt, it is the third of Terry Adonis. He's down, but he's not out, Connor. Jimmy now. With Terry all the way up in, in no man's land. Just chopping, just toying with the man right now. Karate Kid chopping the thoroughbred up top here. What has Jimmy got? Jimmy Conway setting him up. Could this be a big superplex? Terry stopping him. Signed up right now. Let's see if Adonis can fight this off. He needs to because this will be the end of his afternoon if he does not. Terry's in a bad way, but if this lands, he's really done, and he gets Jimmy off. Much needed opening for the thoroughbred. Is Adonis going to fly? Adonis is going to fly. Oh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Not the type of flight he was hoping to make, but Jimmy Conway crash and burn when Adonis. Just two. Still life left in the thoroughbred. What a big fall for Terry Adonis. You know, Sean, I am surprised he kicked out. I will give that to Terry. He is a bit resilient. Yeah, there's one thing that Terry Adonis has, it's heart. You literally have to stop the man's breath to stop his will to win. Oh, and Jimmy Conway's trying to do that right now with these rights. Clobbering Terry right between the eyes. All right, hasn't Conway learned his lesson? Yeah, he learned his lesson. You see it right there. Yeah, that, that crooked referee, Tiffany. In the pocket of Terry Adonis, there he comes, Jimmy. I want to send a shout out to my commentary partner for this contest, CJD, the finest purveyor of fake news the world has ever created. I'm sick of you. Listen, Sean, I call it how I see it, and I am seeing Jimmy Conway you forgot your glasses systematically on, I didn't take you. apart the thoroughbred. Well, that's not a lie. This has been a systematic beatdown from beginning to end, but not without the entire help of Luca Brazzi. But Adonis is still in this thing. Like I said, as long as he's breathing, he's still got a chance. Conway maybe looking to set up that superplex one more time. And we got a little bit of deja vu here. A big strike from Jimmy. Maybe this time is the charm. You got to keep an eye on Brazzi on the outside, though. Oh, and another shot to the midsection from Adonis, trying to break free once again. Oh, but this time a headbutt from Conway. Big old headbutt. Reverse deja vu. Is it superplex time? Let's see. Looks to be. Adonis, wait a minute. Adonis not letting it go. Oh, and there it is. Caught him right in the temple. Now will Adonis fly? Let's see. But down goes Conway. Thought he was all right, but clearly Terry, he's not. Terry has the biggest opening that he's had in this match. A big opportunity for the thoroughbred right now. Can he cash it in? Let's see. He has 
Perched the on landers. that second rope. And there it is! And a big move from Adonis. Forearm shot right between the eyes of the gent, Jimmy Conway. And now Terry Adonis is starting to feed off this energy from the Battlefield Nation. You can see him, you can see him filling the tank with every clap. Now Adonis has got him lined up. Head of Filling steam. Up post. Big stinger splash. Maximum height. Irish whip. Oh, wait a minute. Conway with the reversal off the rope. Swing and a miss. Oh, and there it is. Big shoulder block from Terry Adonis. Terry Adonis using a football background to bring down Jimmy Conway. Terry trying to get everything he can. He's trying to get the, the support of this crowd behind him. Conway back to his feet. Terry, big thrust kick. Thrust kick ended right in the sternum. All oh, fireman's carry. Adonis has him set. Let's see. And they Samoan drop. That and Terry I wonder Adonis, who taught him that, Connor. That Terry Adonis Samoan drop. Oh, and there it is. Side to side. The elbow smash right to the heart. There we go. Wait a minute. <laughs> Luca Brasi up on the apron once again. This contest was over. He's got that Gabba Ghoul, Sean. Just pull him out. Yeah, there you go. Come on, Luca. Oh, there what? we go. Luca Brasi tossed in and let's go. Terry Adonis, give him what he deserves. Got him up. Luca Brasi in a bad way. And down. Massive Samoan drop from Terry Adonis. Jimmy oh. Conway, another low blow, oh, another man. low blow. Oh, Jimmy, off the ropes. Scissor kick, scissor kick down into a pile of pursuit. Come on. Are you and kidding once me? Once again. Jerry Adonis, another loss. Here is your winner, <laughs> the Jet, Sean, Jimmy Can you believe Conway. what we just saw? Both members of South Phillies. I'm disgusted. I am absolutely disgusted by what I just saw. Jimmy Conway, and as you'll see right now on our instant replay, that's a low blow. Another low it. blow from Jimmy Conway. And then, to top it off, scissors kick right to the pile of pursuit, and that was the end of the day for Terry Adonis. But it was not because he wasn't game today. Terry Adonis controlled this contest. But it was the numbers game from beginning to end. Luca Brasi got involved over and over again. And you're looking at the only reason that this contest did not go Terry Adonis' way. It's without a doubt Luca Brasi. Terry Adonis should have known that the numbers game were going to be a factor in this match. And he didn't bring any help. I, Sean, I, I think Terry needs to go back to the drawing board. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you what, Terry Adonis is not a guy that is happy or has any sort of enjoyment out of taking a loss. So you gotta believe that Terry Adonis is gonna go back to the drawing board and Terry Adonis will be back and better than ever. Mark my words, CJD. Write it in your little notebook today that I said Terry Adonis is gonna be back and he is going to be the end of Brasi and Conway. Oh, he better find a partner. He better find somebody that can be in his corner because it's not going to splash. Well, we hope you've enjoyed the action we've brought you so far this week on Saturday Morning Superstars, but I wanted to take a pause and remind you guys that the entire Battlefield Pro Wrestling Library is available for your perusal right now on the Premier Streaming Network. It's the best $9.99 you'll spend a month, and you get so much live action from some of the best independent promotions across the United States and worldwide, even stretching out to China. So take it from me, take a moment, head to watchonpremiere.com and see what the world is talking about and check out the Premier Streaming Network. But let's get back to the action. You want to see it? It's main event time and that's right now. Ladies and gentlemen, the following singles competition is for the BPW Futures Championship. And his scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. There we go, Joe. You know, Joe, I've known Terry Adonis my entire life. I grew up next to this guy, and oh my God, he, he just annoys me. Terry Adonis, really? Yeah, he, I, I can't tell you what it is. There's just something about him, something about his smirk. 
Because he has charisma, you don't? Uh, hey, I, he just, something about him is a little too cocky for me. Because he's in shape and you aren't? Hey. He's an athlete and you aren't? I mean, what, what's your beef with Terry Adonis? I love this kid. Well, regardless of my personal feelings of Terry Adonis, this has been earned. It has been her Terry Adonis. Listen to this crowd. That tells you everything you need to know. But he's taking on another crowd favorite, Danger Jameson, who just recently captured the BPW Future Championship last month. This is going to be a very interesting dynamic. We're going to have a DEFCON 1 Night 2 Future Championship on the line. And his opponent. I like to, I like to liken Danger Jameson. He, he very much reminds me of Mick Foley. <laughs> you know what, Joe? I see it. And he looks a little festive here tonight. Danger Claws in the house. Everything about this guy is absolutely fantastic. Danger Jameson uh, becoming the future's champion at our last pay-per-view. What, what an upset that was. What a Cinderella story for Danger Jameson. Cinderella story indeed, but is that Cinderella story? Is, is the clock gonna strike midnight tonight on Danger Jameson? Well, Danger, he's got a tall task ahead of him, both literally and figuratively. Very respectful, Danger Jameson. With the championship announcements. Introducing the challenger, hailing from the Valley, Pennsylvania, weighing at 250 pounds, he is Terry. The Thoroughbred Adonis! He is the last student of the Super Dave Osborne Stunt Academy, hailing from Danger Delphia, Pennsylvania, and your BPW Futures Champion, Danger! A fitting introduction for the BPW Futures Champion, Danger Jameson, as he takes on the thoroughbred up-and-comer Terry Adonis here tonight. Futures Championship on the line, DEFCON 1, Night 2. Tommy Pro presenting the coveted prize to both competitors. This is going to be a barn burner, Joe. You've been hanging out with the Vetranos? <laughs> yes, I have. And this is exactly what I figured, the show of respect. Both these guys, class acts. Nothing wrong with a little sportsmanship here at the battlefield. Nothing at all. Bell is about to sound here. And it's real, Joe. It's damn real. Futures championship. What do you think about the size difference here? Completely different builds for these two. You know what? Looks can be deceiving when it comes to professional wrestling, so who knows? I don't know if this is a good idea for Danger Jameson. <laughs> I don't know about that either. I mean, test of strength. <laughs> I mean, Terry Adonis has the leverage being taller and, and whatnot. Oh, oh, look at this. Danger Jameson fighting back, but Terry said no. <laughs> Beautiful lake trip by the thoroughbred. Danger sends him back, but Terry Adonis has a receipt for him. There you go, big arm drag. Terry Adonis able to put the brakes on. What is the elevation on that drop kick? Massive drop kick. Hits Danger square in the face. Terry Adonis now. Alabama slam. Alabama slam. No, Danger out the back door into the roll up. Got a trip here. Danger Jameson. Headbutt to the gut. Right off of uh, Mount Stuntmore with the headbutt there from Danger. Speaking of McFoley. Yeah, going for, going for the double on DDT. Not bad. Terry Adonis had a steam, but Danger gets an elbow up. Sure does. Danger perched up, up, able to get that elbow right in the jaw area of the thoroughbred. Oh, we're going to see it. We're going to see it. <laughs> Here's our big ass stunt for DEFCON. Stunter taker, as he likes to call it. Absolutely. Not quite. Terry Adonis, he's caught him. Had it scouted. If he nails this Alabama slam, it could be over. Oh, my goodness, he does. Plants him right in the center of the ring. As you saw, Danger Jameson bounced. What impact. Terry Adonis goes for the three, can't quite get it. Danger is still in this. 
My word. My word is right. The impact on that Alabama slammer really knocked everything out of Danger Jamison, but Danger, he's got something. Old Dange fighting back, gotta love it. But look at Terry Dunn, you can see the way he throws those hooks. Again, amateur boxing background from Terry Dodd loading up. Oh, but Dave just took his damn head off. He barely did. Danger Jamison. Danger digging down deep. Let's take another look at this Alabama slam. Terry Dodd Damn, Danger Jamison was airborne for half a second after hitting the mat there. But Terry, he's got to he's got to fight back into this danger. Just oh, he clotheslined him and then he suplexed him right on top of his own head. Overhead, belly to belly. Dane staying on top of him. Release German suplex. And there you go, that double arm. He DDT. nailed him with the double underhook DDT. This could be it. Not quite. Terry Adonis throws that shoulder up. And here we go, Danger Jamison, he, he's thinking of another stunt here. He wants to put away the thoroughbred. This could end, this could end very ugly. And it does! Nobody home! He called that one, Joe. Nobody home for Danger Jamison as Terry Adonis looks ready. Look at the agility as he just jumps to his feet. Unbelievable. Terry Adonis maybe going for Colts Crossing Looking here. for it. He's got it! He nailed him! We're gonna have a new champion, Carter! And Terry Adonis! coming unglued! Terry Adonis! Here is your winner, and the new BPW Utah's champion! Terry Adonis! Terry the Thoroughbred Adonis! We have a new champion! Terry Adonis just... He just knocked off Danger Jameson! We have a new Futures Champion, Joe. What a night for Terry Adonis. That title means everything to this young man. Look at the fire. Look at the passion. He's going to carry that flag for BPW Futures, undoubtedly. And God bless anybody that tries to take it off of him. And then I have a replay. Colts crossing, as he calls it. Look at the impact here. Look at the height. Wham. He ain't kicking out of that. Danger Jameson just got put through the mat. And the scene back in the ring, a hug between these two competitors. We saw it at the beginning of the match and at the end of it. Love to see the show of respect. Danger Jameson, hey, he knows he was just outclassed. Maybe it was a fluke that he won the title in the first place. But he doesn't care. He got to live his moment. Now he's letting Perry Adonis stand in the spotlight and live his. Pure class from Danger Jameson and Perry Adonis. That's what it's all about. The celebration continues for the thoroughbred Terry Adonis. This the place new erupted. The Connor. new futures champion of the world. The fastest rising star in the battlefield, maybe next to Kate Thorne, but the fastest rising star in the battlefield. Jody. Oh, Yo, what's no. that music? This is this can only mean one thing, and I don't like this at all. No, Luca Blasi, he Luca Blasi has an opportunity to for a championship match at any time and place. Winning the Medal of Liberty last night. Terry Adonis better look behind him. There's the gent! Jimmy Conway just low blow Terry Adonis! What the hell is he doing here? And here comes Brazzi. No, this can't happen like this. With that bet over the side of the head of the thoroughbred. There's Luca taking his opportunity. He's giving it to the referee. He is, he's cashing in the Medal of Liberty. Less than 24 hours after winning it.
The following contest is scheduled for one for lands for the BBW Futures Championship. And Luca Brazzi, as you just mentioned, Joe, is cashed in his Medal of Liberty. It took two of them as they used weapons. Brazzi going for the cover. Oh! And Terry Adonis. That was two. Two count only, thank goodness. Come on, kid. Terry Adonis is going to have to dig down deep. Brazzi, he's going to the top rope. Luca going up high red district. This would be an absolute travesty if he wins this title after this kid just had his moment. Massive frog splash. And the gym leader, as he calls himself. No, not kidding. Put him away. Terry Adonis isn't going away without a fight. They're going to have to kill this kid. Come on, Terry. Terry's up. Not quite. And Brazzi brings him down into a cross face. Oh, that's agonizing, reaching on that shoulder, that face area, right on the bridge of the nose, come on. He's so close. Brazzi's He's so trying close. to pull him back away from the ropes. Inches away. Here we go, right back into it. Look at Brazzi able to center him, and he's, he's got it cinched in now. Connor, this could be oh, this could be it. I can't believe this is happening. And Terry Adonis has, he's tapped out. Terry Adonis has tapped out. And not even five minutes after winning the damn thing. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your new PPW Futures Champion, Luca Brazzi. I am sick to my stomach. Not even five minutes after lifting the belt above his head, Luca Brazzi has taken it from Terry Adonis. The line is the Futures Champion. As we look at this replay, Terry Adonis trapped in that crossface. No other choice but to tap out. Terry Adonis went to war with Danger Jameson and Luca Brasi, he picked the bones. Regardless of my personal feelings of Terry Adonis, he's just been screwed by South Philly's finest. Screwed isn't the word. They use bats, they use clubs, took two of them after the guy just had a match of his own. This is, this is pathetic. I, I'm, I'm beside myself, Connor. I, I don't know what to say. Luca Brazzi calls himself the gym leader. Well, that belt, some, that belt cements it. And he did it with every underhanded tactic that you possibly can. The gym leader of what? <laughs> Apparently the Futures Division Being now. a scumbag? I can't believe what we just witnessed. We went from the highest of highs with Terry Adonis capturing the BPW Futures title to now the wind being taken out of this place. Absolutely sick. Jimmy Conway. Sick to my stomach. Jimmy Conway job jacking with the crowd here, but I don't know if Terry Donis knows what happened. No, the, the scene in the ring is a confused Terry Adonis as Luca Brasi shows his championship. Nonetheless, Luca Brazzi cashing in that Medal of Liberty. Oh my God. Now entering the battlefield. Oh, oh, it's in the way. It's the father of the battlefield. And he's got a chair. I don't think Alpha really cares about winning the belt. He just wants to put the hurt on Sean Maluda, and he did just that. But Alpha, ah, what the hell did we just see? Gene Snitsky just hit Alpha Jr. in the back of the chair. Eight years ago, when I got picked, Uno, the number 
number one draft pick around here offered you to promise me I would be the champion. And you promised me. You promised me, Alpha. BPW, you're on notice. Snitsky is numero uno. And that is my fault. We want to thank each and every one of you for spending your Saturday morning with us right here on the Premier Streaming Network. And remember, folks, we're going to be back with another brand new edition of Saturday Morning Superstars next Saturday at 10 o'clock. It's the best hour of wrestling that you will find, and you can find it only on the Premier Streaming Network and our YouTube channel. So until next week for Battlefield Pro Wrestling, I'm Big Sean Greymark. Take care of yourself and each other, and be sure to tune in next Saturday at 10 o'clock.